Christian back at safety now. Does that feel more comfortable for you? And was it a move that you were kind of maybe looking forward to when the coaches let you know? Um, I wouldn't say looking forward to because I didn't, I didn't really have a clue that I was going to be moved back to safety. But um, you said as, uh, as far as do, like, do I like it more or am I more comfortable there? I, I mean, I played safety my freshman year. So, um, you know, playing corner definitely helped me, you know, gain, gain just that point of view um, and learning the defense better. So I wouldn't say that, um, you know, I'm happy that I got moved back to safety. But, you know, I just pride myself on being versatile. So uh, if safety is what, you know, my team needs me to play, then I got to be proficient there. How would you say that this group has really risen to the level of competition that it houses this spring? Uh, yeah, I mean, it's, it's fiercely competitive in our room, but you know, we all love each other. Um, there's, no, there's no animosity in our room. There's uh, no one hating on each other. Someone makes a play, everybody's happy for them. Um, you know, the, the competition again, it is fierce, but you know, we all love on each other. We all want to help each other learn and just uh, become as great as possible as soon as possible. Who are some guys on offense that you've gone up against that have caught your eye, whether it's newcomers or returning guys? Uh, I would say, you know, you know, being in safety, being in the run fit more. So I would say uh, I've seen a lot of improvement, you know, in, in Jalen Wright's game um, and just uh, staying with the theme of running backs, uh, Jay Wright, D. Samp. Um, I feel like uh, just as far as from the end of the season to this uh, spring, you know, I've seen uh, with my own eyes a lot of growth uh, for them too, specifically. I would assume you guys are not watching film of last season at this point. Uh, how, when, did you get, when did you guys watch film of last season? What was the takeaways of w when y'all reviewed that film? Um, from last season, you know, just uh, I would say just, and this is in general, just being more consistent, you know, um, communicating well, um, knowing your job, and then when you know your job, doing your job at a high level. Um, you know, obviously we review, we review tape from last year just like everybody does. But um, we, we just took the approach of, you know, <clears throat> trying to, you know, take pride in the little details and just get better from, a, you know, a increment point of view, you know. You can't, you're not going to become great at everything at once, you know what I'm saying? So just taking pride in the details. Are you also watching film of last season now or are you just watching spring? Um, you know, maybe if we're learning a coverage or something, you know, maybe a cut up of some things from last season. But primarily in, within our meeting room, we're watching spring ball right now. Christian, how, how healthy are you? And how frustrating was it at points in times last year when um, you had to miss a game or a week or, or something like that when you were trying to, you know, get into a groove at corner? Uh, yeah, as far as me being healthy, I feel good, man. Uh, I feel, feel really good. Um, but, you know, it's, it's definitely frustrating. You know, no, no one wants to get hurt. No one wants to miss games, you know. Um, but I guess I just, not even I guess, I took it as an opportunity to uh, grow my game in other ways, you know, just become uh, more mentally there, um, lock in to the details as far as schematically, coverage-wise, what uh, diving, not, not to say I wasn't doing it when I was playing, but, you know, just having that different point of view because, you know, when your body can't be there, you have to make up for it in a way, and I just uh, try to do it with my mind. Now that Joe's the guy and he was at the Orange Bowl, what do you see from him in terms of leadership and, and trying to impact this team? Man, I see, I see Joe as, as our leader, man. He and, and the thing is, uh, just because just he got thrusted into the role now as, a, as the starter or the guy, you know, in a sense now, um, he was a leader before, before he was a guy, man. Uh, me, and Joe, me and Joe are pretty close. So, you know, I, I see Joe as, uh, as you know, our, our leader, our guy. Uh, I, if I can, I can look to him at any point, if I'm down, he's going to pick me up. And, you know, I would say I, I could do the same thing for him uh, and, and vice versa. So, um, you know, man, I, I love Joe, man. Christian, what, what's it like in the safety room with you guys? You got some, some older guys like Jalen and Wes and then a couple of young guys, a couple of second-year guys. Getting back in that room or around that group more on a more consistent basis, what's it been like uh, in that room? Uh, when you say more on a consistent basis, I mean, I was, I was seeing my guys all the time last year, even still playing corner. But, I mean, again, being specifically in the safety room, you know, it's a, it's a great atmosphere, you know. We, have, we do have a good mix of, you know, uh, younger guys and some veteran guys. But, you know, we, we – we, uh, we, always try to have fun. And then, you know, the veteran guys, I just see them just always pouring into the younger guys, you know? Um, whether it's me, whether it's um, John Slaughter, whether it's a Jack Luttrell, you know? It's just uh, such, we're just such a close group and we all just want to see each other be great. So, so bad, for sure. Last one to air. So Christian, you played corner last year. You played a little quarterback in <laughs> high school. Yeah. 
do you feel like you're maybe more well equipped to, to see the game from different views, and, and that should go to help you a whole lot at safety? Yeah, for sure. I mean, I've definitely, I've definitely had a, I would say, pretty unique opportunity to see the game from, um, you know, multiple different perspectives. Um, so, I mean, I, I would, I would say it's definitely broadened my, uh, my view as far as you know, uh, maybe understanding quarterback mannerisms or things like that. All right. Thank you. Thank you all.